Right, so our next patient is an 83-year-old um, who's had significant um, peripheral vascular disease, has had uh, multiple arterial uh, vascular intervention uh, procedures. Um, she had, uh, when she first came to see us a couple months ago, she had um, basically two necrotic toes. Um, uh, the first, uh, on her first dressing change when we uh, took it down, um, her second toe had almost uh, pretty much auto-amputated. Um, uh, the big toe was also um, quite necrotic. Uh, the daughter had been applying her own dressings on there and um, it just looked really bad. Um, she has a bone infection in there. Um, they had refused any sort of IV antibiotics. Um, so we've been doing kind of a mixture of oral antibiotics as well as topical antibiotics. Had a bit of an infection in here, um, but again, you know, it's looking very good overall. Um, you're still doing the Venelex cream, I'm assuming, okay and the antibiotic powder and everything in there. Good, good. So that's actually looking really good. So that was just a little scab in there. Yeah. How are you feeling? How's that? Yeah, how's that feeling right now? Doing okay? Good. Good, I'll take a tissue number, small tissue number. Just removing some of that slough in there. And surprisingly, um, you're, you're still doing pretty well from a blood flow standpoint, so I'm pretty happy with that. Um, you know, we, we had talked about this before, how uh, Dr. Suresh had said that there wasn't much more that could be done from a vascular standpoint, so I think the addition of the um, of the creams as well as like the topical antibiotic powder, the Venelex seems to like appear to be helping out quite a bit. You're getting good um, bleeding as we're debriding this. How are you feeling? You still doing okay? Just hurting a little bit. Okay. I don't have to do as much as I usually would because, again, it's still looking pretty good. All right. So, again, it's actually coming in quite a bit more. I don't know if you've also noticed, but as some of that tissue is coming up, this is also, yeah, the toe's lifting back up too. So it looks like, you know, it's trying to come back together. Yeah. So as it's trying to come back together and it fills in a little bit more, what we'll probably end up doing is um, helping it along a little bit. As long as you've got um, some there's no biofilm, bacteria, or anything in there. We'll be able to do um, some additional grafting or um, apply some sort of um, amniotic product or something in there to kind of help it along and, and finally close up, all right? But I'm pretty happy with the progress so far, all things considered, you yeah. know? All right, I know, <laughs> I know.